Are you a power-hungry Uber geek tired of carrying around 15 adapters wherever you go? On this episode of Gadget, we've got the Kensington Ultra Portable Notebook Power Adapter. We'd like to thank our production sponsors, the University Catholic Center, the California Province of the Society of Jesus, and Gateway. And welcome back to Gadget at the Techstop.net. It's a place where it's always time to get your geek on. I'm your host, Father Robert Balliser of the Society of Jesus. I'm a member of the California Province of the Jesuits. We're the largest religious order in the Catholic Church. And we're here in the Center for Apostolic Technology in Honolulu, Hawaii. Now, before we get on to the tech, I, I, again, want to ask everyone out there, especially if you're downloading this, if you're one of the twenty to 40,000 people who have downloaded the last couple of episodes, please please go to our YouTube page at www.youtube.com forward slash gadget. That's gadget TTS. And uh, register, subscribe. It takes five minutes to create an account, and it will really help us when we try to get out there to the manufacturers and prove that we've got the audience that needs to see the gear that they have. Now, also... If you register at the tech stop at www.thetechstop.net, you'll uh, quickly find out that we've started to collect swag, uh, little gifts here and there from, from our sponsors that we're going to start giving away. But we can't do that until we hit a couple of milestones and until you register at YouTube and thetechstop.net. So please, if you've got some time, drop by YouTube, comment, rate, subscribe, drop by thetechstop.net, read a couple of stories, and, uh, well, we'll see you on the web. Now let's get to the tech. Today we're talking about power. Now power is one of those things that is a, a constant need for every Uber geek. I mean, we've got laptops and cell phones and media devices and, and uh, iPods and, and, and phones and, and just things that require power. Now over the years, we've become much better about being frugal with our power demands. I remember a time when it was fantastic if a laptop could get an hour of battery time. Now a laptop like this will get between three to six. I remember a time when if you could get 45 minutes of talk time on a cell phone, that was unheard of. And now we've shrunk it down to the size of my palm and been able to go a couple of days between recharges. Now, even though we have those advances in technology, we still need a way to charge it, and that gets us to the little adapter problem. Anyone who's traveled knows that the, the bits and pieces, the, the iPods and the cell phones and the laptops and whatever else you might carry need adapters, and those adapters are often bigger or heavier or bulkier than the devices that they're designed to charge. Well, we've got a product here from our friends over at Kensington. This is the Ultra Portable Notebook Power Adapter. And even though it's designed for notebooks, it's, it's unique in that it can charge from several different sources to several different devices. In other words, it's designed to be a universal power adapter, something that will allow you to carry one unit that can supply power and charge to all of your Uber Geek gear. Now, we've had a couple of weeks to play with this, to, to rip it up and, and try to blow it up and, and plug it into everything that we've got in the office. And this is what we found. The Wall Auto Air Ultra Portable Notebook Adapter Model 33197 is Kensington's universal AC-DC power adapter. Weighing only 8 ounces and measuring 5.6 inches long by 3 inches wide and less than 3 quarters of an inch thick, there's a good chance that it will be lighter and smaller than the power adapter that was included with your laptop. The Kensington adapter is designed to power and charge all of your devices from pretty much any available source of power. There's an AC input on one end of the adapter and a DC input on the side. It auto switches between 120 and 240 volts AC power and has cords that let you draw 12 to 16 volts of DC from your vehicle, aircraft accessory plug, or any other source of compatible DC power. From the power port on the other end of the adapter, you can draw up to a maximum of 120 watts of sustained power, making it compatible with all but the most power-hungry personal electronic devices on the market, and it can do it all without having to select voltages or worry about polarity. This is accomplished by using a series of Kensington Smart Tips. These tips are not only sized for particular models of notebooks and electronic devices, but they contain all the circuitry to ensure that the correct voltage and polarity is applied to your gear. 
As an added bonus, the Kensington Smart Tips are compatible across the entire line of Kensington Power accessories, meaning that you can add universal power adapters, extension cables, and international travel plugs as needed. In our retail pack, Kensington included 12 Smart Tips and an output cable to connect them to an adapter. The adapter is compatible with laptops from Dell, HP Compaq, Acer, Gateway, Fujitsu, IBM, Lenovo, Toshiba, and Sony. We tried it with everything from our power frugal Dell Latitude D410 to a 17-inch PowerPig HP Pavilion. It powered and charged our Gateway M series, our IBM ThinkPad, and every other laptop that we could find, all with the tips that were included in the package. As for your other personal electronic items, the adapter can charge and power pretty much any USB device as well as cell phones from Motorola, Nokia, Samsung, LG, Sony, Ericsson, and RIM. It can also power PDAs, if you still have one of those, as well as the most popular portable entertainment devices like the Nintendo Game Boy, Sony PSP, or other media devices like the Creative Zen and Apple's iPods. Kensington also included all the straps, pockets, flaps, and bags that you need to keep your ultra-portable notebook adapter, well, portable. We really liked the Kensington adapter. We found it to be lightweight, very flexible, and powerful enough for all of our gear. We did wish that they had used a standard AC power plug and had some way to power and charge both a notebook and a USB device at the same time. But overall, it is still a very competent power device. The Kensington Ultra Portable Notebook Power Adapter is available now. Pricing is a bit strange, with Kensington offering a full retail version at about $150, but I've been able to find street prices for what looks to be the OEM version, with tips for less than $50. The Kensington Ultra Portable Notebook Power Adapter isn't the first universal power solution that we've had on the show. That honor actually went to the APC UPA9, which is a wonderful piece of gear. This is actually for my personal kit. It's what I use to charge my laptops and my cell phone, and my MP3 player, my PDA when I'm on the go. And there are a couple of advantages to this unit. First of all, it's a little lighter, a little bit smaller than the Kensington unit. It has this built-in USB port, which makes it easier for me to plug in the dongles and the cables that I get from the odd piece of gear that I might carry with me. But most importantly, it leverages the fact that it uses the same tips and accessories as other pieces of APC gear, including this, the UPB90, which is an uh, external universal battery. It, it gives you that sort of one-stop shop for people who just want to be able to expand their power solutions as their power needs grow. Now, that being said, there are a couple of big advantages to the Kensington gear. First, the fact that it supplies more power. This is about 75 watts, this is 120 watts, which means that it will supply power even to the most power-hungry notebooks out there, the 17-inch widescreen behemoths, even the most power-hungry notebook that we've ever had in the lab, which was the Gateway P171FX, you know, the two-hard drive monster that just needed a bit more than the APC gear could handle. Now, this also tends to be a bit cheaper. Now, the prices are in flux right now. I mean, it's about 150 bucks on the Kensington website, but we found it on the street for as low as 50 for an OEM version. So, depending on what you need, this could be either less expensive or just about the same cost as this, or if you need a lot of tips, a bit more. So, shop around and see exactly what you're looking for. If you want a complete power solution, you might want to go with something like the APC. But if you just want something that's going to replace your stock power adapter, something that's going to replace the, the, the little wall warts that you need for your cell phone and your iPod and your, whatever other gear you might carry with you, if you want something that we found to be very durable, very dependable, and very easy to use, then might I suggest you check out the Kensington Ultra Portable Notebook Power Adapter? It might be the last power unit you ever have to buy. Now, if you want to find out more about this gear and what we thought about it, you can always go to our website at www.thetechstop.net. If you click on the Gadget tab, you'll be able to find links to all of our episodes in high resolution. If you want to send us an email message, and please keep those messages coming, you can reach us at gadget at thetechstop.net. Well, I've been your host, Father Robert Ballasere. This has been the Center for Apostolic Technology. And remember, there's no Uber Geek without you.